hey, hey, all right, Dogman X, and let's go ahead and merge up. That's right, our nightclub vehicles. Terabyte, Mule, Pounder, you name it. So to get started, your B2 in your nightclub needs to be maxed out. Have one elegy per vehicle that you want to go ahead and merge over those mods. Okay, now do note, I'm going to pull this bad boy out. I already accepted a vehicle from my friend, Ghosted One, thank you. Now, once you're out here with the LG, go ahead and request your mobile operation center, your MOC, with that special vehicle in the back. And we're going to push that vehicle to B2. For some reason, B2 is kind of special. Once we're right at our MOC, we're going to go ahead and hit right on the D-pad and accept alert to push this to B2. Easy breezy, fast and easy. So now that special vehicle that we received through gift card to friends is in B2. So let's head over to my nightclub. I'm going to show you exactly the vehicle that we're going to be transferring over the mods to. That it works. Because it's not modded yet. It's not merged. Nothing. So I'm going to return my LG back to my MOC now. And I'm going to go into my nightclub, my first level, to showcase the vehicles. Now, stay tuned till the end. I'll showcase some photos as well. But as you can see here, this is just plain Jane. I put a crew color on there. Nothing crazy, right? So let's go ahead and merge this bad boy. Let's transfer the mods. The other ones I've already done. Didn't want to make a huge video about every single one, so I wanted to showcase this one. Perfect. Now we'll head over to B2, where we're going to start to transfer over the mods. It's quite simple. So pay attention. Basement level two. Now this is where my LG was. Remember, we drove out, went over to our MOC, and we push that vehicle that I received so I can actually merge over the mods to my vehicle that's in the designated spot. So as you can see, here we are. Perfect. We're simply just going to jump in, hit right on that D-pad, and voila. Change one or two things on this bad boy. It's going to transfer over to the vehicle that's in the designated spot. Now, I don't know. I like the F1s. You got the Yankee plate, right? Green window tint. Do your thing. It's pretty nice. You can accept these and then transfer over the mods. Put a new group color on there. Oh, let me know in the comments. I think I might have to go a little darker with this purple, but pretty sweet. Now you can change anything. Easy breezy, fast and easy. Perfect. Now let's go check it out, see if it transferred over, which you've seen it before. It was plain Jane. So let's go ahead and head over to our level one once again. And I'll invite my friend over, take a look. He helped me out. Really appreciate him. Now again, I'll put the steps in the description below. Also with the video, if you're not familiar with the strip club method. And do this now, because it probably will get patched. Let me invite Ghost1, so he can actually see that my set's all done. But, look at this. I don't know about the colors though. I think I might have to go a little darker. But, pretty sweet. Didn't have to delete anything. Nothing like that stay in the spot so it's perfect b2 is a special floor so look at that now i suggest changing one or two things again on this primary vehicle that's in that designated spot now something to note very important you will not be able to change the plate okay so if you wanted a custom plate on there with a fancy name you can't do it unless you delete the one from b2 as you can see here look at Trust me, I didn't hit a daily sell limit, nothing like that. It's because the one that is downstairs is affecting this one. So what we're going to do is go online, go to Benny's, and order a Elegy. Replace it over the one that you took from your friend. Okay, so we're going to do that. I go up to my B2, and then I'm just going to simply purchase it over the Speedo Custom and delete it. Voila. So now you're good to go. Once that vehicle has arrived, you can jump back into the Speedo and change the plate to a custom plate. Just don't lose that Yankton, you know what I'm saying? There he is, Ghosted One. So greatly appreciate Ghosted One for helping me out. We knocked it out, but take advantage of this. Now it's probably going to get patched within the next couple days. Not gonna lie. But yeah, the color I'm gonna have to change up. So. But as far as the plate goes, you know, you have to wait until the vehicle arrives. That way you can jump back in and then change it up to a custom plate. 
let's see here. Let's jump back in here. And then hit right on the D-pad, go down to your plates, and then voila. So, yeah, that's the only deleting that you have to really do. You don't have to worry about deleting every single vehicle. Just take that in from gift card to friends and merge it up. Hopefully you liked the video. If you did, leave a comment, hit that thumb, subscribe, turn those notifications on. But as always, be good. See ya.